Hello everyone, how is everyone doing today? So today I will be doing an Alaskan souvenir and clothing haul. In last week's video, I told you guys about my Alaskan cruise adventure that I went on in the beginning of July and I had such a great time there. If you haven't checked that video out and if you want to know more about my cruise, make sure to click the very first link in the description below. Anyways, at the end of that video, I mentioned that I will be making a video about what I bought in Alaska including souvenirs, uh, gifts, and clothing, basically anything that I bought there. So here it is. So I've decided that I will show you each item one by one and give you a little information about it, including like where I got it, how much it was, and all that other stuff, and I'll do it about each one. Oh, and also, before we go on to the cruise ship, the staff at the cruise port gave us a book of coupons that we were able to use in our time in Alaska, and the book looks something like this. It was filled with so many different types of coupons that we were able to use and I think it was only for tourists only. So let's get to it. So the very first thing that I bought was actually in the very first shop that I walked in in Juneau. So as I was walking around the shop, this cool awesome thing caught my attention. I really had no idea what this was until I read and looked at the coupon book. This thing is called a liquid motion paperweight. I don't even know what's inside of this and I don't know why it's called that. The only thing that I know is it looks pretty great on my desk shelf. It has a killer whale and a cruise ship inside and it's floating on some sort of blue oily liquid. And on the outside it says Alaska as you can all see and it was only $3.99 American. So it wasn't that expensive. I also in the exact same shop bought a keychain with my name on it. And it isn't just any ordinary keychain, it is a solar powered keychain. So I'm not sure if you can see it or not, but the keychain screen has my name blinking on and off constantly. And on the back it also says Alaska as well. Also, since it's solar powered, I once in a while have to put it in the sunlight so it can get charged. It was only like $2 I believe. The third thing that I bought was in Skateway, Alaska. They were all clothes. Well, I mean, I only bought two pieces of clothing there, so... So the first piece of clothing that I bought there was this nice comfy t-shirt. And it says, Alaska, the last frontier. And it was only like $1.99. The second piece of clothing that I bought there was this sweater. I will be likely using this in the winter time when it's like below 0 degrees celsius. It looks pretty big on camera which it is because I'm not planning to wear this in public, I'm only going to wear this at home as a pajama shirt. I purposely bought a larger size because since I'm just gonna wear it at home, why not buy a larger size so it can fit me for the next at least 2 or 3 years. It is a pretty high quality sweater, it has the fluff inside like the cotton inside, and it's a pretty thick and cozy sweater. On it, it says Skateway Alaska as you can all see, and it was only 15 bucks. The next thing that I bought was also another clothing item, and it was this sweater that I am wearing right now. It's very comfy, and I think I wore it over 10 times already since I got it. And believe it or not, this t-shirt was only 99 cents, and it also came with this deck of cards. It was with this coupon book of course, and when we were heading onto the cruise ship, they gave us 5 of those books at least, and I was stupid enough not to bring them along with me, but if we did, we could have bought more of these shirts. It came with a free deck of cards with every purchase, which is insane because this is a really beautiful design deck of cards, and I don't plan on opening this at all. And on this t-shirt, as you can see, it says, I heart Alaska, which I do. I love Alaska. The next thing that I bought was not a clothing item, I promise. That's enough t-shirts and sweaters for me. So we went into a jewelry shop in Ketchikan, and it was filled with very expensive rings, diamond, gold, and stones. So with that being said, why not buy some gold? And by gold, I mean this. This is a bottle or jar, whatever you want to call it, filled with shaved flake pieces of gold. It is said to be real 24 karat gold inside of this bottle, but you never know. It might be fake or most likely it could be real. But I thought, why not buy this since it will look nice on display on my desk shelf. And it was only $4.99, so why not? And it does look like real gold though, don't get me wrong. The very last thing that I bought was this fancy Alaskan cup. Which was surprisingly 99 cents again, and of course I had to use the coupon book again. It 
was originally 5 bucks for this mug, so why not save an extra few bucks on a high quality drinking mug? It says on it Alaska's Inside Passage as you can see, and on the map it has the points of interest in Alaska. And on the other side of the mug, it has the company name, year of establishment, and all that other information. It is a pretty good looking cup to be honest. So this next thing, and I am aware that I said last, but this next thing was not bought. It is this postcard. And it's not any ordinary postcard because it has a picture of our ship on the front of the card. And I actually got this from our room, and each room has one of these cards, and I'm pretty sure they let people take them. It was for free, so I mean like, why not? That pretty sums up everything that I bought from my cruise vacation. It wasn't a lot of cool, exciting stuff, but it was mostly like clothing and souvenirs, and this was like my third time being there, so there wasn't anything special to buy. So that is going to be it for this Alaskan souvenir and clothing haul slash video. If you like this video and you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. That really helps me a lot. And also, if you are brand new to this channel, make sure to subscribe by clicking here. And also click the two boxes below to watch my two previous videos, including my Alaskan cruise adventure. And you can do so by clicking on the left box. Also, follow me on Twitter of all the links below. Thank you all for watching, and as always, I'll see you with another brand new video next week. See you soon.